New developments, 18 Huskies were confiscated from a home in Springfield. This comes as officials say the shelter has reached capacity. News Channel 20's Kyra Willis joins us live now with how this intake of animals is impacting the Sangamon County Animal Control Center. Kyra. Officials say the Sangamon County Animal Control and Adoption Center is at capacity and has been for years. It's only gotten worse since the pandemic, saying this recent intake isn't helping. Now, the Sangamon County Public Health Director John Bridley says they're doing everything they can to create room for the new Huskies. He says while the shelter is at capacity, they are prepared to house the Huskies while they wait for their owner to claim them. We make the room to do that. Um, you know, there are some dogs that we can you know, put together in, in kennels that, you know, uh, cohabitate well. Uh, but we've, you know, we're always able to make room uh, for uh, situations like this. Ridley says the shelter has been working to free up space by having more adoption events and lowering their adoption fees. Now, Ridley says the county is giving the owners seven days to claim the Huskies. Otherwise, the dogs will become property of the animal control shelter. Reporting live in Springfield, I'm Kyra Willis. Back to you. Thanks, Kyra. Ridley says he believes the Huskies will be adopted pretty quickly if they aren't claimed. Now, this case involving the 18 Huskies is bringing back up a debate over a proposed Springfield ordinance. Alderwoman Erin Conley and Sangamon County Board member Mark Ayers says they were pushing for the proposal, which would require dog breeders to be registered in hopes of stopping what's known as backyard breeding. However, Ridley says the ordinance would not completely solve the issue. Thanks for watching. Stick around by subscribing today and don't miss a single video.